Right now, firefighters are battling a major fire at a market on Ocean Boulevard. Uh, Ray Brewer is there at the scene. Uh, Ray, this is still very much an active scene, right? Very much active. Sean, want to give you a look here at what firefighters are dealing with. And you can see that the fire, while not as high on the uh, roof of the building as it was when we first arrived, appears to have spread a little bit more to the back of the building. Now, I was able to talk to Seabrook's uh, police uh, fire chief Edwards very briefly as there's still a very active scene. I asked him what were the problems uh, with this fire. He said, you name it. He said, wind, getting water to the scene, personnel very tired from an exhausting day yesterday. Yesterday. Now we've also learned a little bit more about this building that there were two rental units in this building. The fire chief says that a total of seven people were home at the time this fire break broke out. All made it out safely. They're being sheltered at a local motel. Now the fire chief says that one of the occupants in those rental units smelled the smoke about 3.30 in the morning, said the apartment was on fire, but whether or not the fire actually started in that apartment, the chief says it's too soon to tell. Now, there are a number of businesses around the Catalano's Market here in Seabrook. The chief says that a business just to the north of it, fire did impinge on it a little bit, but they were able to keep it pretty much confined to this one building. Talked to a neighbor, said she smelled smoke about 3.30 in the morning, was worried about that the flames were so high, was worried about the fire jumping the road. That did not happen again. The good news as far as this fire is concerned is that no one has been injured. Reporting live in Seabrook, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.